What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of uh, That Probably Shouldn't Even Exist. That's a bad idea for a game show. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Y'all Are Making Me Uncomfortable. If this is your first time to the channel. What's up, guys? How are you doing today? Go ahead and hit subscribe. Hit like. Doesn't matter if you've seen my content. It's free to do. And you can always undo that decision if at the end of the video you don't like me. But if you're a returning subscriber, what's up, dude? Welcome back to the fucking cool kids table. Take a seat with all of us cool kids. <laughs> I'm just joking. We, we have fun here. We have fun here. You know, today we're going to be checking out a segment on a channel called Cut where they usually pick a father and a daughter or a mother and a son or two people who would be uh, very good at keeping secrets from each other and they hook them up to lie detector tests and they make them uncomfortable in hopes to earn some cash. It's basically moment of truth, um, but not as good, so. <laughs> All right, let's get into it. This one's called Daughter Takes a Lie Detector Test with Her Dad. So, probably gonna get a little icky, a little yucky, dude. It's probably gonna make us go, ugh, a little bit, but that's kinda what this channel's built on, so. Buckle up, buckaroo. Welcome to Fess Up. Answer truthfully and win cash. How close would you say you two are? I work for him. Well, I don't work for him. For my company <laughs> that I own. She works for me. You'll notice to your right there is a man. Uh, I'm Herb Irvine. I'm a polygraph examiner. Can Woo! We try the Big Herb fan. Herb, what do you think about that? Can we try the bullet? I don't know, Herb. What do you think about that? Try. G Herb. Give it a shot. Well, today, your dad can tell the truth for all these questions. Madison, you get $200. All of them? I mean, this can't get us in trouble for, like, legally. Anything I, can't I, say. That. I gotta say, 200 bucks uh, for just exposing some secrets that you, or something that'll probably make you uncomfortable, but it doesn't seem, doesn't really seem that worth it. That's kind of what the entire channel of Cut is about, is just giving people money to make their life a little bit more awkward. And usually it's not enough cash to justify it, really. So, yeah, a lot of times on their channel, you see the ugliest side of people, and it rocks. <laughs> All right, let's begin round one. <laughs> Have you ever been attracted to one of my friends? <laughs> Will I have to say the truth? Yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. Dumbest question I've ever heard. No, you don't have to, but you're literally hooked up to a polygraph lie detector test, though. So, it doesn't really matter what you say, does it? Just, just grit your teeth and earn the cash, buddy. You signed up for this. <laughs> Yes, I mean, she's gorgeous. What friend? He is yeah. telling the truth. I mean, she's gorgeous. So Herb's like, yeah, he's telling the truth. She's fucking hot, dude. I've seen her. I've seen her, dude. Everybody likes her. Are you kidding me? Yeah, so it's not yes. my fault. Let's move on to question two, then. That's only one question. Yeah. How many do we have? Have you done any illegal drugs in the last month? No. How about the last three months? Answer true. Yes, yes, you have. Yes. Okay. Answer true. Daughter's kind of doing the dad dirty there, hey? Which was a fun alliteration, kind of a tongue twister. She only had to ask the first question. She kind of upped the ante there. Why are you doing that? Why would you do that to your papa, your pee pee? Why would you do that to your poo poo like that? <laughs> yes, yes, you have. Yes. Okay. He is telling the truth. Okay. Do you see why you're not a good influence on me and why I fuck up all the time? Well, I'm trying to show you how to not, fuck up, but not to do. I feel like I'm in the room when I'm not supposed to be in the room during like a family uh, disagreement. I feel like the most awkward dinner guest right now. It's clear that these two came on here and have some sort of resentment toward each other, which sucks, dude, because like, you know, now that that's kind of probably why they came on this show is to like air it out in probably one of the more unhealthy ways to do it in order to earn some cash and also in front of a whole bunch of people. That's kind of fucked up, dude. Next one, have you ever done butt stuff? Yes. <laughs> Who hasn't? He is telling the truth. This man does like butt stuff. <laughs> Herb's like, yeah, he did. <laughs> It's a weird question because like, does it mean that he did it to somebody else or does it mean that he had it done to him? Weird one to answer regardless, isn't it? Especially to your daughter who seems kind of like she dislikes you and will use that 
information to her advantage. What kind of butt stuff have you done and with who? Well, she's not going to like it. So you're saying with mom you well, did butt I stuff? I wasn't going to say that. You shouldn't say it. Okay. <laughs> okay. You know what that means? I win the money! You win the money! I win the money. We split the money. We split the money. Have you sexted anyone in the last month? Yes, gross, dude. You gonna ask your daughter that, dude? Fucking gross, bro. Actually, it's probably not gross. Like, some of these discussions, it's funnier to pretend that it's like, you shouldn't say that, but a lot of these things, it's like, they're kind of, they're not really as taboo as they maybe once were in an open family. So, like, I'm, I'm fucking around here, but realistically, like, it's not that big of a deal, you know? Sex isn't demonic. It's gonna be okay. If I went longer, would you say yes? Yeah. <laughs> you know that goes everywhere. She is telling the truth. Why don't you send new pics? I send them to your mom all the time. Next question. She says she has Next to go question. to the bathroom. Next she's question. She's not. That's not what she's doing. Next question. Ugh. <laughs> Too much info, bro. Chill out. Do you shave your pubes? <laughs> <laughs> Do you shave your pubes? Ah, I hate it so much. I hate it. Thanks, Cut. I hate it. Yeah, I just wanted to make a return. Yeah, no, no, it's a, it's a memory. There's no returns. Oh, oh, there's no, there's no refunds on that. I'm stuck with that for life. Thanks, Cut. <laughs> yes. A lot of people trim. No, I like a baby's, like a baby. Oh no. Well, don't say baby. Stop it. <laughs> don't say baby when you're talking about pubes like hey don't say that though you know oh that though don't say that don't mention babies anytime uh that you're mentioning the style of your pubes and to your dad there's a lot of levels here to this um of just regret <laughs> Let's keep going, I guess. That's disgusting. She uh, is telling the truth. <laughs> I like to imagine that they're not actually hooked up to a lie detector test and it's just Herb just, Herb just knows everything. <laughs> I like to imagine that Herb is the lie detector test and he just, he's all knowing, he's omnipotent and all seeing. <laughs> Do you got a, you got a oh, little no. bush going on? Trim. Trim. Hey, you're not hooked up, bud. Again, chill the fuck out, man. You're making it worse for yourself. <laughs> trim. 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 You trim them? Trim. I don't go to the baby's butt. No. Okay. Trim. All right, what is that next question? <laughs> Thank you, Herb. Herb's the only one in this place that's like got a little bit of sanity to him. Herb's the only one in that room making any sense right now. <laughs> Have you ever stolen from me? Yes, of course. Well, this is one you could try to fool the thing. No, I'm not going to because I want that fool money. Fool yourself and then fool it. She is telling the truth. Uh, about how much? I don't know. Over 5,000? Yeah. Why am I smiling? No. <laughs> She's a little too happy about that, eh? She's way too proud of having stolen a pretty good amount of money from her dad. Maybe he fucking sucks. I don't know. But this is what I meant, man. This is like an argument I shouldn't be privy to, but. Here we are, man. That's <laughs> <laughs> not fucking funny. Her dad's like legitimately not, not cool with this right now, it seems like. I probably wouldn't be either. This chick kind of sucks, dude. Just won another $200. <laughs> I win the money. If you don't want the fess up fun to stop, we have one final round. And if you tell the truth on one final question, Madison has the chance to double her money. I'll take you to the casino if I win this money. Yes, we will do it. All right, oh, now you're doing it to yourself. I'm back on her side. I'm back on her side. This guy fucking sucks. Herb, let me know when you're ready. Oh, no. 
Have you ever had sex at work? Which is my office. Yeah. <laughs> Oral sex counts. No, no, no. I've done some touch some touching. What type of touching was going on at work at my office? At work at my See, you're digging a hole now, dude. You're asking more questions than necessary, so. What type of touching was going on at work at my office? Some butt touching. Butt touching? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Alright, I guess that's why you ask. I wouldn't I was not assuming butt touching. <laughs> what a fun grouping of words though. Butt touching. Butt touching! <laughs> yeah. Craig, do you think she's telling the truth? I think she's telling the truth. Yeah, I have it. I have it. She is telling the truth. Huh. Thank you. All right, guys, there you go. That's the that's the video for today. See why I was saying it's just it's gonna make us all a little bit uncomfortable uh, to watch, but we did it. We got through it, and uh, congratulations. <laughs> this is your second reminder. Go ahead and like the video. Hit subscribe. Join the family. Ring the notification bell. You'll be notified next time I upload because I'd love to see you here again. Peace. Some butt touching. Butt touching? Yeah.